<coughs> okay. Um, a lot of you, uh, not, not a lot, several people in the past have uh, requested me for a very specific feature that is multi doctor. Multi doctor functionality and the duration of the session. Um, when I made this uh, program, uh, my primary concern was uh, to make it as suitable, as, as simple as possible, as straightforward as possible, and especially for dental clinics. So what I imagine is that a single person sitting in his clinic just managing uh, records of few so I never imagined like a huge clinic with uh, multiple doctors managing like hundreds of records. I didn't imagine in that way. So it was made as a simple program to do simple things. But over the years, uh, <coughs> I added some functionalities and it, right now it's kind of in a decent shape. And so several people asked like if you could have multiple doctors and multiple appointment system especially someone who requested it for an autism center where there are different doctors managing appointments in different days um, so i did kind of sort of uh, work around uh, let me show you Okay, this version, uh, let me clear something first. This version is for <coughs> psychologists and autism centers, physiotherapists, that sort of thing. So I got rid of the lab exchanges part and uh, there's something new as you can see here is the personnel. That means you can add um, the person who will be handling an appointment. Maybe a physiotherapist, it may be a counselor, a pediatrician, something like that. So when you go to personnel, you are prompted with this little form. So let's add some, some uh, let's add a personnel, Dr. <coughs> Dr. Imran. Dr. Imran is a, Dr. Imran is a pediatric um, neurologist. <coughs> and he is an MPS, an MD in pediatric neurology. Let's give him his contract number and he lives in Main Street 4B. Whatever address. And when you click add, he will be added to the database and he has a unique uh, <coughs> doctor ID. ID. Click here, show all, and you can see the, all the persons I have already added or what the persons you will have added. Here, you can print the list from here. Now, when I go to the database, I have some sample data here. Let's open a bus. And when I do a session or an appointment, I can select a doctor from here. So I had Dr. Imran, and he's filled, this field will be out of filter. You don't need to fill this. Just enter a day. Today we had an appointment uh, consultation. <coughs> um, during which it was like 30 minutes. And the payment was like whatever your currency is. <coughs> and like, like always, you can print an instant receipt or you can close. And you can always print the invoice and in the invoice you will always have from now on you will have the session durations and the name of the doctor who handled each appointment go to print invoice and you will see the duration this duration will especially help in, in case of psychologists who have a strict <coughs> time duration like half an hour or something like that and whoever handled will be appear will appear in this uh, invoice and 
when you give the patient an uh, future appointment you can also decide that from here for example if we give up a future appointment like uh, 16th of this month 5 30 pm by the way you can edit this list here you can click here and it will allow you to edit whatever time whatever time suits you and here you can actually have assign the appointment so for example if uh, they want another appointment with dr imran you can select it here save now when you go to the appointments page you can actually see that we have an appointment for a bus with dr imran next friday 16 to this month Again, you can search from here. Here is our boss. Appointed to the criminal. So that's basically it. You can now add different doctors and assign appointments to them and add a session duration.